right, boys and girls, go into your clever page and, and click on Adobe Express. Double click, your clever page will open up. And you are going to see up here, there's an A that looks so beautiful like a rainbow, Adobe Express. We are going to create our name in a fantastic design with some design elements around it. So we're gonna scroll down. We're not gonna make a poster, we're not making a flyer. We're not making a resume or a worksheet. We're going to just go to the trending backgrounds. And you're going to look through these trending backgrounds and pick one you like. I'm not very crazy about them. Ah, I think I clicked on one. Let's see what opens up. Gray. Mm, I don't really like it, but I clicked on it. But look over here to the left. Look at all these different backgrounds we could choose from that are much, much nicer. I think I'm gonna go for this one, red and red and yellow. It's asked me, where do I wanna add it? I wanna replace the background that I have. Woo, much nicer. Okay, after you have a background, go all the way to the left and we're going to scroll down we're not going to discover we're not going to templates we're going to go to text click on the text you can add your own text and decide what font you'd like or you can look at all these great texts here and the designs they have are pretty cool we're going to be working on our name so Find one that you think looks cool. I kind of like this one that says hot tip. Click on it. And look, it's going to go over to your design and it says hot tip. Well, I don't want it to say hot tip. I want it to say Miss Kroll. And you're going to put in your name. I'm going to double click on it. See how now there's a box around hot tip? All the way up here on the right hand side, up at the top. I'm going to Backspace and delete hot tip. And I want it to say Miss Kroll. Sorry about the sound in here. Miss period Kroll. And you're going to do your name. Well, I think it's kind of small. So I'd like to enlarge it. Bigger, bigger, bigger. So I'm pulling on these edges to pull it bigger. There we go. And now. I think it's too big. I want that star big too, so I'm going to pull the star bigger, or the star burst. And here's my name. And I'm going to move it over with my mouse. Miss Kroll. Not quite big enough. This one, bigger. You have to kind of learn how to futz around when you're doing graphics, which are letters and simple designs. Oh. I'm sorry my cat is coughing. Okay, Ms. Kroll. Now, I'd like you to go back over here and look, you can add a photo. Let's say you really like cats or animals and pets. You could click on a photo. But I think I'm going to add some shapes. Simple shapes. Oh, I like this smile. I'm going to click on the smile and look, here's the smile. Well, that's too big. So I'm going to click on the smile and I'm going to make it smaller. If I'd like to make it even smaller, just keep going. I want this happy face up here. Now here are the colors. It's this peachy color. I could change this color to yellow. Oh, cute. All right. I'm going to go back over here and pick another design. Ooh, stars. Hmm. I like this one. Ooh, it's pink. I don't think I want that light pink. I'm going to click on this color and change it. There we go. And I'm going to put it up here. Some simple elements. Let's see what other shapes they have. Lots of stars. 
And maybe, hmm, I could view all. Beautiful. Hmm. Maybe that one. Don't really like that color. I think it's dark. Let's shrink it. Move it over. Click on the box over here and change the color. Miss Scroll. Let's see what these are. Design assets. Oh, these are cool. There's all sorts of designs we can add. Oh, look at this cone. That's beautiful. Oh, there it is. I'm going to click on it and I'm going to bring it over here. This is a very strange little design I've made. If you want to turn it, find the arrow. Miss Curl. Let's see. How about the sun? I'm going to click on it again and I'm going to add it somewhere in my picture. So I just want you to play around with the tools and create an interesting design with your name and some of the design elements you find in Adobe Express. They make it so easy for a person to make a fantastic art design. Miss Scroll. One more fun element. I like this overlay at the bottom. Let's see what that looks like. Overlay. Double clicking it. Oh, I put two. <laughs> you only want one, so I'm going to delete that. You notice if I click on it, I can move it around if it has a box around it. Oh, I like that. I'll make it bigger. Looks like I'm looking into the sun. Wow. It's too big. All right, boys and girls, if you want a picture of something, you can type it in. Oh, that looks so cool. Let's say I want a photo of the, the moon, M-O-O-N. I've clicked in here, moon return. Look at all the moons they give me. Fantastic. And I can click on one and I can add it to my picture. I'm going to click on those. I don't like that it has this square shape around it, but I think there's a way we could remove background. Let's try this. Click on this over here, remove background. Let's see if it works. I had to click on that little check mark, but it worked. Look at that. Wow, I want to do one more picture. Okay, watch. I'm going to go over here and look for photos. Click on photo. Now I want a cat. Siamese cat. Siamese. Let's see if they have Siamese cat. Click. There they are. Oh, they're cute. This one looks like my cat. This one and this one. Okay. Siamese cat. And I don't know why they have fish. Here's the Siamese cat. Click. I don't want the background there. I'm going to click on it. I'm going to go all the way over here. Remove background. Let it do its work. It's scrolling. And there you go, the cat's background's gone, and you go all the way up here to the right-hand side, see? Click on that check mark, check mark, and there you go. I'm gonna bring the cat down here because the cat is eating at the bottom of the page, and I'm just moving it around. Ta-da, here is my wacky design that has a little fun things about me. I like suns and moons and just designs and there's my name. All right, boys and girls. My project up here we can download. I think you can download into your computer. Hmm. It is saved. You see up here this little cloud it says saved. Your document is being saved as you work. 
All right. Thank you, boys and girls.